Layers, via styles, and net classes should be configured before routing. You can use Add Layer button or select Insert Layer item from the right click submenu. Dip Trace allows you to create signal, plane, or custom non signal layers. Enter name of the layer, select its color, type, signal or plane, and connect corresponding net. Plated hole dimensions can be specified as well. We create two plane layers for power and ground. Vias and dip trace are organized to via styles. You can create as many of them as you need. Vias can be through hole or blind buried with customized parameters. Changing via style changes all vias of this style. You can create net classes to organize nets. Net classes can be automatically transferred from the schematic module, but advanced parameters should be specified in PCB layout. To add a new net class, press corresponding button and enter name of the class, specify trace width, clearance, and clearance details if you need. You can also choose which via styles will be used for this particular net class. Now select nets from the list and add them to the net class. Create another net class. Notice if you uncheck all layers box, you can set trace width and clearance by layer. In auto routing tab, routing layers for each net class can be selected. Class to class clearances are specified from the same dialog window. Clearance value can be different for each layer. With Route Setup dialog box, you can change default settings at once and get quick access to net classes and via styles. Here, you can also change manual routing parameters. If you're going to create another similar project, but you don't want to create layers, net classes, and via styles again, save your rules into a rule file, which can be loaded later.